Hello and welcome to BSL Club. This is the place where you can learn British Sign Language and become deaf aware. Today's video is all about going back to school. Are you ready? The sign for school, you should use your um, right hand and make short um, waving movements over your mouth. So, school. Let's try that again. School. Remember, you turn your voice off, as in. Now, the sign for primary school is you use your number one, so you twist it slightly, primary school. And again. And similarly for secondary school. And again, secondary school. The sign for nursery, to so use your N hand shape and um, put it on your clavicle area, this area, and flick it up, nursery, nursery. And again, the sign for reception is like welcome, reception, reception. Now for year one, or year two, or year three, any of the years after reception, you can use the um, sign for year, which is your Y hand shape, year one. Year one. Or year two. Year two. And so on as you go through the years. So for example, year seven, year 11. If you're not familiar with BSL numbers, I'll put a link below for my video on BSL numbers and you can learn how to sign numbers in BSL. I'll also put a card up so that you can follow that and watch the video. College, so that's two C handshakes over your forehead, college, some people say college down here, that's okay, college. And again, the sign for university is you use your two pointing fingers and you make a square above your head, university, well, almost a square, like that, university. And the reason why, if you think of somebody who has graduated, they usually wear a hat, don't they? A square hat, a mortarboard. Um, and that is, that is iconic, that sign. So university. Playtime. That's an important sign to know. Playtime. Home time. Or home time, you could sign that. Home time. Home time. Both are acceptable. Lunch time. Lunch time. Break time. Try to use your thumbs, put your thumbs on your chest. Try to lower them slightly like break. You're having a break. Break time. Fingers out. Break time. Now the sign for toilet is using your middle finger, so your middle finger, and you shake it a little bit on your chest. So if you, you're right-handed, you would just bend your hand to touch the right side of your chest and use your middle finger and wiggle it a little bit. Toilet. Now there's lots of signs for toilet. Toilet, but I use this one, so toilet, okay? Toilet. The sign for class is similar to what we said for college. So class, two C hand shapes go round in a circle, class. One more time. And the same, similar for classroom. So classroom. So it's like you're drawing out the room. Classroom. The sign for teacher is your two pointing fingers 
and you put it around your mouth area, both each side, teacher, teacher. Move your fingers forward, teacher, for each syllable, teacher. The sign for friend is two hands, one that is kind of bent, both of them bent and kind of interlocking, friend. Let's do that again. Friend, school friend, for example, school friend. The sign for homework, home work. So it's those two signs put together. Home, so imagine the roof of a house, home, and then work. That's two straight hands, one over the other, and then moving on top of the other. Homework. The sign for playground, you remember the sign for playtime was playtime. So the sign for play is this, play, and then playground, or playground. Either one is fine. So let's try that again, playground. Playground. The sign for sports day is sports day. So for sports, you've got your left hand, if you're right handed, your left hand is flat and your right hand kind of brushes over it. If you are left handed, then it should be your right hand is flat and your left hand brushes over it. I'm going to show you the right handed way. So, Sports day. Sports day. Um, I've already done a video on sports, different sports and hobbies, and I'll put the link down below so that if you are doing any of those sports within your school day, you can add that to your conversation. So, sports day. Reading. So imagine your book and then you are looking at it and reading, reading the, your, these, this thing, these two fingers go along the lines, like you're reading the lines of a book, reading, reading, and writing, so imagine this, your left hand is your paper, and your right hand is your pen, or your pencil, writing, and again, writing, school holiday so to sign holiday use both hands start on the top of your forehead and move up and out slightly so holiday school holidays school holidays fantastic well done now you have learned some signs that might help you to talk about going back to school now, I'm going to do a part two of Back to School Signs, where I'm going to teach you all about the different subjects, English, math, science, and so forth. So stay tuned for that video coming soon. Keep practicing, and until next time, bye-bye.